Do you want those big, horn star like veins on your eggplant? Do you go to extreme lengths to make those veins pop? Honestly, you may have the wrong focus because unlike common belief, veins don't tell you anything about penile blood flow. What you should be focusing on is something else. In this video, I will reveal what it is. How do I know? Because I'm a board certified urologist and specialist in sexual health. So let's dive in. Here's a common misconception. Veins aren't the stars of the show when it comes to better erections. Your arteries are. They are the ones delivering the goods because there are two types of blood vessels, arteries and veins. Arteries carry blood rich in oxygen from the lungs into the end organs. Veins drain used blood low on oxygen from the end organs back to the heart where it is pumped into the lungs for new oxygen. When it comes to penile blood flow, it's not the veins which are important, it's the arteries. So what you want is not big veins, which will rob your penis from all the blood, you want big arteries flooding the cavernous bodies with blood. But here's the catch. Arteries are invisible. They run from the body straight into and through the cavernous bodies. So how do you train your arteries to become bigger and more responsive? I'll come to that in a second, but first let me finish the veins. There are two types of veins, a deep layer and a superficial layer. The deep layer is something you won't be able to see either. With erections, veins are closed so that blood remains inside the organ. Otherwise, blood would enter the cavernous bodies and immediately leave them through the veins. Okay, but still, you would like your eggplant to look like you have seen in the movies. Maybe you feel more confident about yourself if you have them. And stick around until the end, because I'll reveal the secret to making your veins more visible. Though most of you may not need it. As a urologist, I see these misconceptions all the time. But what really matters is that you work on the arteries. They widen and get bigger when a gas is released from their inner lining. This gas is called nitric oxide. So what you have to do is to make sure to eat the right food so that your arteries can produce nitric oxide. That's typically food rich in L-arginine, which is an essential amino acid. You can boost your L-arginine intake by adding certain foods to your diet. Meats like turkey, chicken and beef are excellent sources, while seafood such as salmon, shrimp and tuna provide additional L-arginine. Dairy products like milk, yogurt and cottage cheese also contain this nutrient. However, meat contains a lot of saturated fatty acids which counteract the benefits of a healthy diet if consumed in too high amounts. For this reason, I advocate a plant-based diet with as little meat as possible. A typical plant-based diet will focus on nuts like almonds and pumpkin seeds as well as legumes like lentils, chickpeas and soybeans. Finally, whole grains, spinach and seaweed round out the list of great L-arginine rich foods. That's one important part of what to do. But there's another very important piece of advice that I want to give you. And in fact, this is medical advice. Stop sabotaging yourself. All the L-arginine in the world will not make a difference if you treat your arteries badly. So never smoke and stay away from obesity and diabetes. Monitor your blood pressure. A high blood pressure is an erection killer. This has to be taken care of. Okay, apart from food, make your arteries work by working out. Physical activity is good for them. If you have never worked out before, go to your doctor first and get a physical examination to make sure you are physically fit to do so. So here's what you have to do to make your veins more visible. You have to become leaner. We are talking about 8 to 10% of body fat. At this level, your veins will become very well visible. For most of us, hitting 8 to 10% body fat is tough and it's not necessary. Aim for a healthy 10 to 15%, which is much more sustainable and will still make a big difference. Furthermore, male porn actors may turn to dehydration techniques to increase the visibility of their veins. This is something I absolutely don't support, as it can be dangerous to your health. 
If you're ready to take the next step toward a healthier you, look at this. This video will provide you with detailed information on how to boost nitric oxide production with the right foods. And yes, eggplants are on the menu. See you there. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.